Hello YouTube. I'm back. It's Mr. Angus Wangus. I'm alive. I'm not dead. <laughs> I didn't pass away. Give up my ghost. Uh, I've been uh, catching up on things that I've been neglecting to do for months <laughs> in the last couple weeks. Uh, a few different things on the go. Moved my um, workshop from the spare room to the uh, sunroom which was a huge task because uh, I had completely destroyed the spare room. Couldn't even walk in there. It was awful. <laughs> but anyways, uh, moved that all. It took way more work than I thought it was going to. And then uh, finished out the spare room, fixed it up. And anyways, other things too I'm doing. But, uh, yesterday was my first chance to get back at my projects here and uh, wanted to make a video just to let you guys know what I'm doing, let you know I'm alive. And yes, uh, Jeremy, <laughs> I fell asleep with this in my lap last night. Yeah, others of us do that too. <laughs> Please excuse my neighbor's lawnmower. I hope you can hear me. <clears throat> But anyways, this is my new core for my project. Uh, in previous videos, I had talked about the solid core, how it's better, and how um, I know why now. Um, it's the uh, two opposing magnetic forces interacting in the core, in the iron core. The two uh, different spinning eddy currents and um, this is my new core and um, it's a cast iron uh, pulley off an old pump I just took the angle grinder to the spokes and got it a little smooth today this is going to be my new core I'm going to fit, work on this today and do what I'm doing and I'll make a, a new vid of that for sure but same concept is going to be going on here is here. This is uh, an old Nikola Tesla idea and I'll be talking more about that and um, when I make when I get it hooked up and try it whether it works or not for me um, and explain what my ideas were more here. Just wanted to show what's going on um, with that and you can <laughs> let your mind absorb the differences in what perhaps is going to be going on there but i'll be making a video of that soon uh because i'm going to be working on it now i have more time i had a lot of things that i was doing uh this is my little bedini wheel and this is the other thing i just wanted to say in this short video uh just show uh use number two billion and whatever for the bedini system uh, these are my two 9-volt alkaline batteries for my um, metal detector. And I'm going to be going to have time to go do that and do try that more now too. And uh, that'll be fun. I'll be making bids of that. But they started out, they sat over the winter and lost their charge. They were at 8.7 volts when I started this about 10 minutes ago actually. And now they've increased the volt. I'm going to juice them up. I've got my circuit turned all the way down. 180 milliamps is what it's drawing off this little wall charger right there. Uh, but anyways, just wanted to show these are, you have to have the good <clears throat> alkaline batteries to, to be able to charge them with the Bedini system, but they won't get hot or anything. <clears throat> uh, the, the other thing I want to mention too, a great use for the Bedini, other than charging my batteries and restoring batteries and things like that, is, well, same thing, that's what I'm going to say, I guess, <laughs> is um, my drill batteries. I have a power drill, and I've had it for probably eight years, and normally they had only ever lasted me a couple of years ever, but um, I take my power drill batteries, 12 volts, and put them on here one at a time and juice them up a couple times a year. 
and it keeps the batteries fresh. That's usually what happens with those drills is that the batteries completely die uh, with the usage, right? And um, then people throw them out and, uh, or sell them at garage sales or whatever. But you can keep your drill for a long time if you, if you use it this way and keep the battery in good shape. Um, I, like I said, I've had the drill that I have for about eight years now and um, built, you know, got to be four or five decks with it for myself and other, you know, helping other people. Fences, you know, big stretches of fence. And, but anyways, it's still going strong. But that'll be next because they do need a boost again. Anyways, wanted to share that with you. Mainly wanted to show you what I've been working at and that I'm not dead. <laughs> and that I'm, I'm back at it. I've had lots of things going on that I've been neglecting for a little too long. Got those things straightened out and uh, going to be doing this more. Uh, new ideas, as you can see. And um, it's going to be better. I already know. <laughs> But we'll be making videos of that. There you go. Thanks for watching, listening to me blab. <laughs> and um, I'll have another vid soon. And Bigfoot too. I'm going to go looking for him. I have a little audio recorder um, that I found that I, well, I used to listen to MP3s on. But I'm going to put that out in the woods with some coconut cookies. And uh, be on that too. So there you go, and I'll be making a video of this progress very soon. Thanks for watching. Talk to you later.